Hello friends, welcome back to the new tutorial of the date picker. Today we are going to learn about the React multi date picker examples we are doing. So those who haven't subscribed my channel yet, please do subscribe my channel. And if you like the video, please do like, share and comment on my video. Let's get started. So basically it's a multi date picker. So uh, if you have the requirement like you want to select multiple dates, in that case you can use like suppose this date, that date, this one, that one. So you can select the multiple dates if you want to use. So you can select the multiple dates and you can save it into your backend or you can send them this data to the backend so that they can save and do the rest of the process. Okay, so how we have done this one. So let's have a look of that one. So we have a multiple date picker. So we are using the React multi date picker and uh, here we have defining the default states. So Whenever I do the handle change, so I will, I'm going to set the selected dates and just log it over here. Here you can see that. So selected date maps format I have set and then with the comma separated, I am showing that one. So just mode should be multiple. So in the last that is the mode is uh, I think range. Now the mode is multiple. So if you want to select the multiple dates so that you can just pass the mode to be multiple, right? So this is how you can do with the multi date picker example. Any doubt, any query in that, do let me know in the comment section. Make sure you have to install this package react multi date picker. Okay. Any doubt, any query, do let me know in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching this video. Have a great day and don't forget to like, share and comment on my video. Have a nice day.